If you've ever felt like you needed a notepad in your menu bar just to save some plain text or something, uh, there's a really easy way to do that using Fluid, a site-specific browser application for the Mac, and just an HTML document. To do this, you're going to need Fluid, which you can get for free at fluidapp.com, and pretty much any text editor. In this demo, I'm going to use TextMate, but you can use anything that really edits plain text. We're just going to open up Fluid here, too. Now, you want to create uh, the general structure. So we need a HTML tag, a body tag, a head tag, title tag, etc. Um, and then once that's all set, uh, what we're going to put in there is a text area. Now you can either wrap this in a form tag, which is proper, or you can actually just stick the text area um, tag right in there. And you can set it to whatever size you want. Uh, you'll be able to adjust it once this site-specific browser is created because it's based on WebKit and WebKit has a nice little thing where you can adjust the size of the text area live in the page. So I'm just going to save this to the desktop as notepad.html and then we're going to start filling in the information in Fluid. Now you can either enter in file colon slash slash and then just drag over the uh, HTML document that you made and enter a name and put it in applications and choose an icon um, or you can upload the file to your website and do it remotely that way. Either way hit create and when Fluid's done creating the SSB for you it's going to give you a success window and ask you what you want to do. Hit launch now. When you do that whatever you name the application is going to be the uh, name of the menu you're going to want to go into. In this case it's note menu. Um, so click on that and then choose Convert to Menu Extra SSB. What that's going to do is give you a dialog box. You're going to hit OK and then put it into your menu bar. You'll see the icon you chose up at the top and a little notepad. You're going to want to adjust the size of the window um, so it fits nicely the way you want it, but that's about all you have to do. There are a couple of things you might want to do after this. One is add it to your login items so it starts up every time you log in. And if you're using Spaces or any virtual desktop software, make sure you assign the application to every space so you don't end up going to a specific space every time you click on it. That's all you have to do to get a notepad in your menu bar. Thanks for watching.